Welcome back to my channel, Kentucky Fried Fun. Welcome if you are new, and welcome to day four of Shauna Ray's August week of cleaning collab. Join me as I work in my VIP kid classroom. Don't leave me here forever. Don't let me be alone. Just see you and me together. Don't let me lose her. Here is a look at the room and its messy state and I sad to say it is still kind of like this on this side especially but I was able to really go through my VIP kid section of this room and really organize it for now and how I can use it and it's been really helpful and here are the containers that I will be using for the day. The first area I wanted to work on was this side of the cubbies and just taking some things down and really trying to utilize the cubbies that I have better before possibly adding more storage. If you are new to my channel, my name is Ruth and on my channel you will find cleaning and declutter motivation as well as decoration inspiration. If you like that type of content, I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe. And once you've clicked that red subscribe button, be sure to also click the little bell right next to it so that you don't miss out on any more of my videos. To dust, I'll just be using the Great Value Brand Furniture Polish. This is in participation with Shauna Ray's August week of cleaning collab. This will be my fourth and my final cleaning video for this challenge, but I hope that y'all have enjoyed them so far, and I will be sure to leave a link to Shauna's channel, as well as a link to the playlist and all the other ladies and their cleaning videos up in the cards and down in the description box so that you can go ahead and check those out after you have watched my video. I wanted to do was go ahead and move over my YouTube equipment like my mic and over to this other cubby and there I will also be placing my camera obviously once I'm done filming that way I can utilize the other cubby for VIP kid things Another thing I wanted to do was go through this bin. It basically is just like a bunch of office supplies like glue, staples, things like that. And I just wanted to be able to organize it better and also be able to put my cord for my mic there so that I could just reach down for it and not have to dig through bins. a little more reorganizing in these bins like I took the books out of that one and put in another bin and then the top bin I think I filled with like VIP kit supplies just so that I could reach them better and then I am going through these cubbies and for right now it looks kind of messy but I'm just going to be putting my stuffed animals in the bag as well as these plushies until I can find little cubes to hold them and ones that will actually fit in these uh, cubes because they're not the same size as the other one. So open the way, come again. It's now or never. We're going away. You never know what we will find behind the line. Find behind the line. If you believe in love, give me a feeling. 
I'm taking the books out of that bin so that I could then go through the box of old teaching supplies of mine and go through that and just decide what would be good to stick in this bin that would be easily grabbable and easily to use for VIP kit. a bunch of teaching visuals that I had made back in college a, they are like chalk done like with a projector and things like that I worked really hard on them and laminated them so I'm just or laminated most of them at least so I'm just going to take those out and put them in this nice bag so that they are kept nicely Let's run. last area that I wanted to work on or at least that I filmed for y'all was these two cubbies to the right and basically I just put things in there that I use on a daily basis as well as visuals that I can just easily grab during a class and it has worked amazing I absolutely love the space that I have created so far I still have some work that I want to do I want to work on my background as well as in front of the desk on the other side right in front of our closet I need to work on moving that stuff out of the way it's it's just yeah so that I can actually like open the closet doors there's always something right I did want to go ahead and mention that I have absolutely been loving teaching with VIP Kid. It is so amazing. I absolutely love it. It doesn't even feel like a job. It feels like I'm getting paid for something that I absolutely love to do. And I'm still a beginner. I've only taught about, I was just shy, one shy of 50 classes so far. But I just absolutely love it. If you are at all interested, I would love to hear your questions. Drop them down in the comments. I'm still a beginner, so I may not be able to answer them all. And I also will be sure to leave a link down in the description box, a referral link that you can use if you would like to become a VIP kid teacher yourself. <laughs> Thank y'all so much for watching this video. If you were able to get some cleaning and declutter motivation from it, please be sure to leave my video a big thumbs up. And like I said at the beginning, this is my fourth and final cleaning video for this challenge. So be sure you are subscribed and have your little bell clicked so that you don't miss out on any more cleaning and declutter motivation from my channel. I do have a big declutter video coming out next week that is part of another challenge called The Purge. And y'all, I am going to be purging our garage. That's right. You don't want to miss out on that. I hope y'all have a blessed day and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye!